I tell you, if, my, if man ever went back on the dating scene and that, bro, I, would, I mean, I wouldn't be telling girls, yeah, I've got bare properties and that, because I don't need to tell them that I'm successful. It's not going to make no difference. What I'm saying is, I'll do the opposite. I'll be like, yeah, man. Yeah, man, just trying to get my life back together and that, you know, try, trying to find God and that, trying to, I'll make it seem like I'm lost. Yeah, women like that shit, you know, they like problematic men. Don't you dare have your life in order. Don't you dare have your things then patterned up. Fam, my girl will drop you out for that. Imagine, yeah, my girl has a friend who went out on a date, yeah, with a doctor, okay? So this guy is a doctor, He's six foot six. And in order for her to choose to go out on a date with him, he must have been okay looking, yeah? Do you know what happened? Nothing. Do you know who she ended up with? Some fucking guy that does deliveries. How did you go from going out on a date with a doctor who's six foot six, probably good look, okay looking, no homo, got his life in order? How the fuck did you choose that? Uh, how did you go and choose a guy that does deliveries? It doesn't, it doesn't mean... Well, I know why. I know why. Because women like problematic men. They want to be able to fix a guy. Bro. Yeah, I know, I know what you're saying, um, Salome, about, oh, it's not all women in that. But it's a lot. It's a, it's a lot. It's a lot. And some people, oh, well, maybe the chemistry weren't there. But fuck, I don't give a damn about no damn chem chemistry. You can learn to, people can grow on you, you know.